Lifting Up Jesus, opening his word from Australia, Denmark, Israel, Japan, New Zealand, Northern Ireland, Republic of Ireland, Singapore, South Africa, United Kingdom, Thailand, the Philippines, United States, and throughout the world. You're watching L'Oreal TV. Ask the question. Hi, this is Tim Worth from Morial TV and Morial Radio. I'm here with James Jacob Prash, who is alive and very well in England. Jacob, one of the believers asked the question, should the Christian be buried or is there freedom for the Christian to be cremated according to Scripture? Christians were burned alive in Ephesus. Their corpses were left there, charred. Um, they were cremated, except they weren't dead yet. No one would suggest that somebody who was cremated won't be resurrected or won't go to heaven. We're not talking about that. Uh, with Scripture is silent, we cannot be dogmatic. However, cremation in most civilizations and cultures is something of paganistic origin. And in the Scripture, it was associated with the, with the burning to the, uh, in, in moksha food and witchcraft and things like this. It was associated with people who were eternally damned. It's a figure of, of hell. I don't make any judgments. But I do believe the norm, the preference for believers should be internment. The corpses should be interred. Not, not cremated. If you disagree with me, however, I cannot contend with you doctrinally or to say that it's 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 directly contra-scriptural or anything of this nature. If you have a loved one whose remains were cremated, I'm not saying anything. It's all returned to the elements anyway. It is simply the spiritual and religious symbolism associated with cremation that makes me uncomfortable. Uh, that's the issue I have. But again, I cannot be dogmatic because the Word of God is not. In my personal view, burial is preferred. Not necessarily subterranean burial. It could be in a crypt or something of this nature. But not cremation. Nonetheless, others would disagree. My name is Jacob Prash. God bless. Thank you.